This video will show you how to do a salt dip for your fish. You'll need to dissolve 30 teaspoons of salt per one gallon of water. Make sure that the water's pH and temperature match the tank water. You can actually just use water directly from the main tank if you'd like. For best accuracy, you can weigh out the water and the salt on a scale. One gallon of water weighs about 3,785 grams, and you'll need about 114 grams of salt per gallon of water. I decided that a half a gallon of water would be easier to work with than one full gallon, so here I'm weighing out half a gallon of water, which is about 1,893 grams. Now I'm measuring out enough salt for a half a gallon of water, which is about 57 grams. Pour the salt into the water and stir until it's completely dissolved. Now using another bucket you can get your fish out of the aquarium. Place your fish into the salt water solution and then set a timer for 5 minutes. The fish may seem a little distressed and from time to time it will list sideways. This is completely normal. However, if at any time the fish tips on its side and cannot right itself, then you need to remove it from the salt solution. With minimal disturbance, this fish was able to right itself, so it should stay in the salt solution. One minute! Two minutes. Three minutes.
four minutes. And five minutes. After five minutes have elapsed, remove the fish from the saltwater solution. Then transfer the fish to a holding tank. This can be as simple as a five gallon bucket with dechlorinated water and an air stone, or as elaborate as this quarantine tub you can see here. It is important that pH and temperature are the same as the salt solution water. After one or two hours, the fish can then be placed back into the main tank. As you can see, this fish handled the salt dip quite well and seems no worse for wear.